Hi guys, this is Alicia from WorkersOnBoard.com. I wanted to show you guys how you can self-publish your own books and sell them through CreateSpace. I have talked about this company before and I had a few requests on exactly how you can do this and create your own books or either your music or your films and publish them and sell them through Amazon and a, a lot of different channels so I wanted to show you guys how you can do it today and I wanted to explain a little bit about CreateSpace this is a company that I've used to publish all of my books and it's another way for you guys if you're creative or you um, create content or you like to write or you like to make music or you like to make films and you're a film producer or you want to do this then this is a great company to use because they have all the tools that you need here to use they're free they're easy you can if you have your content already ready then you could have your book ready to sell and publish in a week or so so I'm going to show you guys how to do it so first um, it talks about the different tools that you guys can use underneath this below for independent publishing and that's what you're going to be doing through create space they have a do-it-yourself interior reviewer, a cover creator, and a preview as well as an image gallery and this would be for the cover of your book if you don't have an image already that you would like to use there then they have free images that you could use for the cover of your book. They also have design, editing, and marketing services to help you and then they talk about the distribution options where you can sell your book either through standard distribution which would be on Amazon, Amazon Euro, eStore, and Kindle, or you could use the expanded distribution. And I'll talk a little bit more about that later. If there's always help here, if you if you have any questions and you need help when you go to publish your book or to uh, start the process through Create Space, you could either contact them by phone, email, and they have a whole community of authors and publishers, different. Uh, people that you can connect with to get answers to your questions so what you do when you're on create space you're going to sign up for an account now I'm already logged into my account so if I sign in then it'll just take you to my account but you just need an email address and then pick a password and then you can confirm it and then you can go right here and you can get started so let's click on start a title for free now they do have paid services but you guys you can do this all for free. I never paid anything to um, get my book published and use the tools through Create Space, but you can do this all for free. So it says, take, tell us the name of your project. So let's just make up a title here. I'm going to make up something. And I plan on publishing a paperback book, but of course, you can see the different options there. They have audio, CD, MP3, DVD, or video download. Now, if you've done this several times and if you're familiar with Create Space, you could just do the expert, but I always do the guided tour and, and it'll give you a step by step um, process of how you can do this. And then, of course, you want to come up with the subtitle. And if you can, you could just put it right there and then tell them that the author is going to be your name. You'll put your name in this area here. If you're the only person that contributed to this book, then you could just put yourself. But if there's other people, then you can add their names if they helped you create any of the content. If you had um, another writer or someone else to help you with that, you can put them there. If this book is a part of a series, meaning um, if this book is... Um, going to have other additional copies followed in the same under the same kind of subject or title and you want a series then you could do that and say volume one two or whatever and then addition number see it goes through everything to help you so this talks about how um, if this book is, has been previously published and then you can enter the number one or two whatever if this is um, going to be an addition and then what language um, edition, excuse me, and then what language and then the date you would use today that you're going to publish it. And then you save it <clears throat> and then you go to the next steps. I don't know if it'll let me go to the next step. It may tell me I need to complete this. They will give you an ISB num ISBN number. Now, what 
that is ISBN, I wrote it down, short for International Standard Book Number. It's a 10 digit number that all booksellers need. And your book will be assigned one for free through Create Space. You can also, you know, get your own custom number if you want to for $10 or Universal ISBN for $99. Without that, you will not be able to sell your book. So you have to have an ISB number. So, um, but you could get it for free and do it through Create Space. I did it that way. I'm going to go to the interior of the book and show you guys. You now, there's so many different options. You could use black and white, you have full color, whatever kind of paper you want to use, and you can even pick what size you want your book to be. You don't have to use this professional serv design services down here. You can do it free, like I said, from Create Space. You just select which items you want to. And like it will tell you, you need to do your title before you can continue to this section. But I'm just going to show you guys the steps to show you guys how easy it really is to do a book here. When you're ready to do your cover, then you could go and they have a free online tool where you could go and, and look and see how you want your cover to look. You can click this section. Before I do that, I have to do my title though, but it's telling me they have images for you to use. They can trim it to make it look so professionally. It's it's just a really great service. And then when you're ready to complete your setup, and then you do all of these steps and then you can submit it you can you also need to um, before you can even go this far you would need to definitely upload the books contents so I talked about open office portable before this is a free software download that you can use and you can I'll have the link below this video for that as well as for create space to sign up but open office portable is a free service that you guys can use and you can write your book you can even put links in your book if you want to send them to somewhere else or on a website or wherever you want especially if it's an ebook if it's a paperback book you can't do it which they do paperback books here but you can also sell an ebook through create space for free on Amazon as well so just keep that in mind but you can write your content on open office portable and how you would do that you just um, it's easy you, you think of like for example if you want to write a book think of a title possibly a subtitle think of some the table of contents what you want the book to talk about and some chapters and possibly a conclusion if you want to it's always good to include an introduction in your book because this will allow your readers to get to know you and you can also explain your connection to the book um, and tell them a little bit more about you and what the book will accomplish what you intend for it to accomplish how it will help them now you may be thinking I do not know what to write about I have no clue I I have absolutely no idea what to write about. Well, you could do a cookbook. If you like to cook a lot of different recipes, you could do that. You could write a book about that. You could write a book, an autobiography even about your own life um, and publish it. Or a fiction. Uh, I know fiction sells really well on Amazon. You could write a book of, of fiction. You could write a self-help book. You could even write a book on how to write a book. Sounds funny, but people want to know how to do that. And you could even, you know, mention how you can earn money or make money doing this. And, of course, that would spark some interest because people would be interested in that. So you could write a book about that. You can even write a book on social media. And, you know, if you're an expert in using it and how it could be used to promote a person's business or accelerate their business or you know how they can monetize it whatever you want to do anything that I say anything that you can think of you can write on so you know if this is something that you always thought you wanted to do and you're not sure if you, how you could go about publishing a book create space makes it so easy you don't have to go through a, a long tedious process as, as you would if um, if you went through another source so create space is definitely a, a way for you guys to go when you get done with your book well it won't let me go to the steps here but you can actually proof your book here online and go and make sure that, that everything's correct there's no errors the files are all uploaded correctly it'll show your files and then you can distribute your book 
you could either you you could either do a standard distribution which is free and that will be sold on amazon.com amazon Eero, create space e-store and as well you could do an ebook of your book which would be in the kindle format if you do expanded distribution it will cost you twenty five dollars you don't have to do this option but if you do it'll just be available to more people and so to more places for example it'll be listed in the Ingram catalog Baker and Taylor libraries school institutions retailers and bookstores so it it'll just um, be available in more places that's the difference there and so it's just a one-time $25 fee now if you decide that because on one of my books I didn't do it right away but then like a few months down the line I think I uh, opted for that option you could do that as well when you put a title in here, the title information, if you come up with the title and you want to change it, you can always change it. Um, once your ISB in number is assigned, you cannot go back and change that. But you can always go back and change your title, your subtitle, whatever you want to do. So, you know, that's until you actually, um, you know, uh, proof the book and have it ready to sell. You can always make changes up to that point. But um, I could show you guys my account and then kind of show you um, a book that I published here. I'm going to just kind of show you guys. So this is my ISBN number that creates space assignment. And kind of show you guys a little bit uh, about how I did the book and well, the different things that I put in so I'm just gonna go through this so you guys can see the interior of it like I said you can proof it um, you I uploaded it you could do PDF format or DOC but I told you guys that you could do it through open office portable which is free and you can upload that file that's all that you need you can upload that and then have it online you know on create space upload it when you're ready to do your book and so there's just and then the complete setup it may show you guys um, well I've already made the submissions but anyway I just wanted to go through the steps I'm not sure if I can go back in and do anything to my book unless I wanted to make changes but the way that it works is that your book will be sold on as far as a print on demand kind of thing so when your book is somebody buys your book then they will print it and then you, the book will be sent out to the person that bought it you know so then the way that you make your money I wanted to tell you guys about that because you do earn royalties when your book sells so if you sell twenty dollars worth of books in the month of May then you will get your money if you've reached your payment threshold at the end of June that's how it works. So if you sign up for direct deposit, as long as you earn ten dollars, then you'll get that money. If you signed up just to get a check, then it has to be a hundred dollars. So if you earn a hundred dollars in May, then the end of June they will send you a hundred dollar check, create space will. So the if you I want to go back and show you guys um, on one of those titles that I had. I can go to I think my account but you can go it may be in the beginning too um, but you can even if you, you do want to think of how much you want to sell your book for and if you're not really sure you can go it could be in the beginning too it'll tell you how the royalty so you can go in here and um, watch this um, video you can also for example it'll tell you how your royalties work but you could also pick, let's just do a dummy setup here. Say we're going to have a book that's 50 pages long. We want to sell it for, I don't know, say $12.99, for example. Then it'll show you how much you're going to earn for that book. So I'm going to calculate. This is how much you're going to make. So you can always make changes to this number right here. You can do 1099, for example, because if you're not sure exactly how much you want to sell it for, it'll tell you how much royalties you will get. Um, you can play around with this number. And you can also play around with the number of pages. Just see what it brings up. And <clears throat> you can sell it, 
you know, online, you guys, through Create Space. It's an Amazon. This is an Amazon company. They have all the tools that you need to get your book published and to sell it on Amazon and all these other channels. It's free. Everything from the overview, overview of your book to the cover. You don't have to pay for professional covers. You can just use, they have a lot of images there from the interior to your printing options, if you want it in black and white or in color, how you can distribute it through, through the different channels that I talked about. And even you can buy copies of your own book, like you can order a proof before you sell it. And you can even talk to somebody online. So it's, you know, a free service that you guys may want to use if you ever thought about publishing your own book or either um, if you thought about if you make your own music and you want to sell it here or you make films, you can do all of that here and you can sell it on Create Space. It's a great service. I highly recommend it. Um, I use it and I think that you guys will really, really like it. Like I said, if you can't think of anything or you do, you can think of something, but maybe you don't want to spend the time to write a book for yourself. You could hire someone on Fiverr or hire um, an ebook writer to help you write that book, and then you could just add them as an author, you know, as a contributor to your book. So you can give them credit for that content if you want to do it that way. But you guys, it's a way for you guys to earn royalties, revenue every month if you sell enough books, you know, forever for the lifetime of your book. So I just wanted to make a video to show you guys how to do this. Now if you have any questions or comments about Create Space or anything that I possibly could have left out, make sure you leave me those below. And I'll have the link for Create Space below this video as well as for Open Office Portable for you guys to go and check out. You can download it to your computer. It's free. You can write your book there. And thank you guys so much for watching and make sure you check out for my next video.